Hello. Oh my god! There is no way! <laughs> there is no way! I literally just beat it. <laughs> oh. It's over. Oh my god. <laughs> that is probably the best completion I could have ever asked for. That is so funny. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, hold on. Let me count up, count up attempts. 17,476 plus... 5,242, 22,718 attempts. Oh, and did I? I plus. No, we'll go with it. Um. Oh, that is great. I guess I might as well sit here and give my opinion on the level. So, I'm gonna be honest, I really don't like this. It is such a bad level. When I first uh, was looking for levels to beat, like, I wanted to do a jump. I've been wanting to do a jump ever since, like, it was either Blade of Justice or The Lost Existence. Uh, so after Scoop and Hell, I decided, let's do the jump. Uh, I got inspired from some other people playing Sonic Wave. I was thinking, I'll play it for fun. I got to the wave, and I was like, huh, cool, and then left it there. Like, the next day, I kept playing it, and playing it, uh, until I got runs of it. Oh, my music's still playing. <laughs> until I got runs of it. Uh, so I got, like, good runs, and I was like, hey, well, I think I might try this if I can get past the first, like, if I can do the first wave in its entirety. I did the first wave, and I, I, I just went for it. Uh, then of course I got, uh, I started progressing quite quickly, actually, until I hit, like, I think it was after my 54 death is when the level started to become frustrating, boring. Like, all the comments you usually see about people saying about Sonic Wave, they'll usually say, like, the pre-drop is boring, it's unfun to play, it's somewhat unbalanced there's a lot of choke points i never really understood it at first but now i get it. it is such a pain to play for context surprisingly this was more painful to play than the lost existence and i hate the lost existence it is not a good level this somehow even worse i don't know how but it's somehow even worse i don't know if it's just because I'm doing, like, such a big jump. Or it's just because it's a bad level. I'm thinking it's just because, you know, it's a bad level. Uh, to get to specifics, uh... Uh, let's see. The first cube, obviously that infamous jump in between the, the spike and the saw. Literally a frame perfect. No matter what refresh rate you're on, is literally a frame perfect. Uh, other than that, it's fine. The ship, surprisingly, if you're on like 144 plus, it's actually very easy and almost free. Uh, it's um, it's pretty much just the transitions into the portals. That's just a little bit wonky, but even those are pretty okay. The ball though, absolutely horrendous. The ball is the worst okay maybe not the worst but it's the worst pre-drop i've ever played and beat or beat in a level literally the second half 
or maybe even the first half, I don't know. But in the middle of it, the infamous clicks, literally, they feel, they're not frame perfect, but they feel like they're frame perfect, and I hate them. And some of the orb clicks are really weird. And that dual ball, mini ball, surprisingly is much worse than it looks. The first wave, surprisingly okay. I hate the first, like, two clicks. Uh, and, like, those really tight corridor parts in some of the mini waves. I really hate those. I found myself dying to them a lot. I didn't die too much when I switched to three. Because I decided yesterday I'm gonna, I was gonna try Sonic Wave on 360. So, yesterday and today I was doing that. Surprisingly, I wasn't dying too much there. But, it's still bad. Uh, and of course, uh, it's very spammy in some parts. I really don't like that. That one part where it slams you on the floor and the roof, uh, it may look easy. It's much harder than it looks. Who knows? It, you can get consistent at it, but I don't know. I didn't find myself too consistent at it. Me getting past it was like a... I don't know. It was almost like a 50-50. Uh, I usually, I mean, I guess I would usually pass it like 60, maybe 70% of the time, but every time I died there, I don't know, it just kind of hurt. Uh, the first cube, other than that first blind jump uh, from the transition, it, it's alright. The second wave, very stupid. First two clicks, kind of stupid. Uh, I don't like how most of it, like, you're upside down. I really don't like that. Uh, that's just not good. I don't like uh upside down wave gameplay in my opinion it's just not that fun to play it's just not great uh surprisingly okay i haven't said this before but i've actually died at that cube after the second wave like five times i've died at 86 twice like you know that one part where if you jump accidentally you hit like an invisible little block i've done that twice yeah, and I've done another time. I've